hello you are welcome how to solve this system of equation and uh, we are finding the x cube plus y cube let's label this as equation one and this as equation two from equation one here from equation one we have x square minus y square equals to 16. now let's square both sides of this equation square this side and also square this side then the expansion of this will simply give us x to the power of 4 because we square x squared as x to the power of 4 now then minus 2 times x squared times y squared that's minus 2 x squared y squared then plus y to the power of 4 as well when we square minus y squared that gives us plus y to the power of 4 then equals to 16 square here will give us 256 and uh, in the next step let's bring the power of 4 together we have x to the power of 4 plus y to the power of 4 then minus 2 here since this are power of 2 we take it outside that's xy to the power of 2 equals to 256 and uh, from here we can replace xy from equation 2 as 15 we are given xy to be 15 instead of writing xy here we simply put the value of xy which is 15 and we have x to the power of 4 plus y to the power of 4 minus 2 multiplied by 15 squared is equals to 256 and from here when we simplify we are going to have x to the power of 4 plus y to the power 4 minus 2 multiplied by 15 square is 225 then equals to 256 also 2 times 225 they give us 450 so we have x to the power 4 plus y to the power 4 minus 450 is equals to 256 and we can carry this minus 4 50 to this side become plus so this will then give us x to the power 4 plus y to the power 4 then equals to 706 when we take this and we have it then let's divide this as equation 3 and also from this identity we have x square plus y square all square when we expand this what we have from here will be x to power 4 plus y to power 4 plus 2 x square y square then we are we want to find x square plus y square from here then we already know x raised to power 4 plus y raised to power 4 to be 706 so let's replace equation 3 here so this becomes 706 plus here we already know this will be 2 into bracket xy square and xy is 15 then square so this will give us 706 plus here yeah, this 225 15 square is 225 times 2 will give us 450 so we have 706 plus 450 there and from there we have x square plus y square or square will then be equals to 1156 then let's take the square root on both sides we square root this side and square root cancel square here so we have x square plus y square will then be equals to 34 from here then let's divide this as equation 4 also let's find the uh, from this identity when we have x plus y or square we can expand this and this will give us x squared plus y squared then plus 2xy we want to find x plus y from here such that we know already that x squared plus y squared is 34 so put here as 34 then plus 2 times xy we know that will be 15 and then that's 34 plus 30 2 times 15 is 30 and that gives us 64 that means we have x plus y 
all square equals to 64. We take the square root on both sides as well, square root on this side and square root on this side. Square cancel square root here, we have x plus y will then be equals to 8 from here. Then we are want to find x cube plus y cube from this identity. This simply equals to x plus y multiplied by x squared plus y squared minus xy then from here we already got our x plus y to be 8 so we have here will be equals to 8 then multiply by we already got x squared plus y squared to be 34 then we have 34 then minus xy from equation 2 is 15 then when we solve this that means we have x cube plus y cube. This will now give us x cube plus y cube will then be equals to 8 multiplied by 34 minus 15 there give us 19. So when we multiply 8 multiplied by 19, that means x cube plus y cube that we are interested in finding will then be equals to 152. So here we have the solution to the problem. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and also turn on the notification bell. Share this video and give it a thumbs up. See you in the next class and bye for now.